brain! Hey, Trixie here, live. And I don't need to tell you about the crime wave hitting Slug Terra. It's been almost a week, and our mystery thief is still stealing stuff all over. on the hunt right now. But if anyone out there knows where this thief is, I do. <gasps> She's right here. Hey! Dana Poor? Oh, can you say that again? I want everyone to know who's the best thief in Slug Terra. <laughs> <laughs> If she does, she'll find us waiting. Yes, well, uh, let us hope she does not keep us waiting too long. <laughs> Pronto needs a snack. We don't even know for sure she's gonna try and rob the Cavern Museum. She will. She's hit pretty much every other high-security target in Slug Terra. And disappeared into thin air. Not to mention she's posted enough clues for us on the Slug Net, using my camera. Well, while we wait, I'm gonna dive into this week's crossword and win me some loot. Uh, sorry. <clears throat> Pronto still needs a snack. And I need a nine-letter word for flim flam that starts with a B. Try bamboozle. Dana! But how could she have gotten in? Less talking, more slugging that camera stealer! <laughs> <laughs> Careful, Trixie. You don't want to set off the alarm system, but I do. Scatter! Of it. My camera! That's enough, Dana. When we first met, I thought maybe we could actually be friends. We gave you every chance to do the right thing. But you're just a no-good thief. <laughs> yep. And there's nothing you can do to stop me. Oh, yeah? You're not the only one with an arachnid slug. There's nothing you can do that Spinner and I can't. <laughs> Ow! No way! No way she could have gotten through there! Ah! Uh, yeah, well, she did. It's like she just disappeared into the shadow. Uh, huh? But how? Yeah! 
Yes, we did it again. <coughs> Gotta say, though, that one's gonna be hard to talk. <laughs> and I think I know just the place. <coughs> one last job, and we can retire the best thieves in the history of Slug Terra. Guys, it may not have been our best night, but the museum wasn't a total disaster. Yeah, bamboozle. I never would have gotten that. At least no one saw us flailing around like a, a bunch of floppers. Yeah. She posted it on the slug net with my camera. I still don't get what Dana thinks she's doing. The only thing she took from the museum is a t-shirt from the gift shop. Well... Besides making us look bad, I'd say she's doing it for the fun of busting into any place she wants. And the fact that no one can stop her. In that case, the thrill ride's coming to an end. There's nowhere harder to get into than the museum. No. There is one place. Dr. Black's. You catch that slug ball game last night? Blade City Brutes killed it. something worth stealing in here. <laughs> well, well, what do we have here? <laughs> Got it. <laughs> ah, yeah. May I help you? Who are you? Just a no-good thief. Relax. I just wanted to see the look on your face when I... <laughs> okay, that's not the look I was hoping for. <laughs> Please, just take the blaster back. Oh, I intend to. You won't be leaving with anything. In fact, you won't be leaving at all! I... I should have known better. After all, having your blaster stolen? That's just about the most humiliating thing that can happen to a slinger. Everything okay, boss? I heard... I've... lost something. I'll gather up the boys. No. I'd rather keep this quiet. Leave it to me, boss. I'll find someone who can discreetly eliminate this problem. Whoa, that was a close one. But I'm still the best. <laughs> I bet Dr. Black is losing his mind right about now. I didn't realize this would be an audition. That's a pity. For you. Allow me to introduce myself. I am... Yeah, yeah. You're the one they call... The Gentleman. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's not polite to interrupt. I was going to say... I am the chap who's going to get this job. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You talk funny. <laughs> <laughs> You should not have doubted me, my friends. A gentleman always keeps his word. I believe we found our man. 
I have two things I need delivered to me. A blaster and the girl who took it. Relax. We're safe up here. We covered our tracks. But not your trail. Who? Oh, I think you know who I am, don't you, little thief? Then you know how this will end. You can have the blaster. Take it! It was only a joke. That would make this easier for me. But not for you, I'm afraid. I promised my employer that blaster and you. And a gentleman always keeps his word. <laughs> Now, where could you have gotten to, my dear? Let's follow the trail, shall we? Don't mind me. Just passing through. <laughs> Interesting. What a waste. Ten hours in the bush staking out the entrance to Black's cavern. Maybe she had another way in. Ah, trust me! If a tracker as keen-eyed and sharp-nosed as Pronto cannot find her, then a pawn cannot be found. Aha! You see? Apparently, I'm even better than I thought. Yeah, yeah. You caught me. Now, hurry up and close the door. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? You had us chasing our tails like a bunch of floppers. And now I'm turning myself in. My camera! I don't get it. Why would you just give up? <laughs> That's why. <laughs> Calls himself the gentleman. He's working for Dr. Black. So you did try to steal from Black? Try. I did. And now, Black wants payback. Allow me to introduce myself. I am... It, Dana told me about you, and the blaster. It's inside. You're welcome to it. Unfortunately, I will have to decline your offer, unless the girl comes with it. Can't do that. I don't like what she's done, but I'm not gonna hand her over to Dr. Black. I gave her my word. That I can certainly appreciate. So it appears we will have to find another way out of this impasse. Impasse? 23 across? Thanks! Not very polite to leave without saying goodbye. <laughs> to leave without saying goodbye. Uh, 
a mere distraction. Exactly! I guess Dana bolted. Guess again. So what do we do with her now? I got some ideas. If I could take back all the stuff I did, trust me, I would. And we should just take your word for that? Her? No, you should take mine. I trust her. Thanks, Eli. For everything. Don't thank me. Prove me right. I believe I know what happens next. I don't think you do. We're letting you go. We are? Bro, this dude's one of the bad guys. And he's good with words. Even if we return his blaster, Black is still gonna hunt her down. This is what we have to do to protect her. You're gonna go to Black and tell him to meet me in Chilbore Cavern, alone. And this is exactly how it's gonna go down. So here we are. Well, do you have it or not? Then give it to me. I'm here as you asked, alone, unarmed. Can't believe you actually kept your word. <sighs> you should have trusted those instincts. Guess I should have known you'd lie. Uh, about several things. <laughs> <laughs> Her name's Dana. She's a friend of mine. certain that Geoshar did its job. A gentleman always keeps his word. It's okay, bro. We got gotcha. you. And these slugs are safe, too. Thanks to Pronto. Dude, if he crystallized her heart, or her brain. He didn't. <laughs> what happened? Exactly what we planned. You're gonna go to Black and tell him to meet me in Chilbore Cavern, alone. And this is exactly how it's gonna go down. We're going to convince Black she's taken care of. Even with the blaster back, Black won't let this end without drawing blood. So you're gonna use that eye of yours to hit Dana in just the right spot to make it look like she's finished. Without, you know, actually hurting her. We got a deal? It looks as if I have no choice but to agree. But I am a man of my word. I promised Dr. Black I'd bring him the blaster and the girl. And you're going to do exactly that. And then you're going to keep your word to me. So now that Black thinks I'm at the bottom of the Under River, that's it? I'm in the clear? As long as you lay low, which means no more stealing. Thanks. 
Don't thank me. Prove me right. I will. Whoa! Where'd she go? She bamboozled us. I thought I could trust her. You can. Shadow Clan tech. So that's how you did it. Where'd you get this? Inside your crate. The one with the Shadow Talker. This thing lets me walk through the shadows just like the Shadow Clan. And you just took it? That's what I do. What I used to do. I'm giving everything I stole back, including this. No. Uh, excuse me, but is that some sort of code where no means yes? Because this seems like the kind of extremely powerful device that Dr. Black would love to get his hands on. Well, that's why Dana's gonna keep it. Safest place for it is with someone Black no longer thinks exists. Besides, I trust her with it. So do I. I'll keep it safe. I promise. I'm, um, pretty good at keeping out of sight. Good. Because I have a feeling we're gonna have to use that thing again. I have one question. I need a four-letter word. S-L blank G. Slug. Slug! Oh, that fits! Thanks, guys. <laughs> One of the primary sources of light in slug terror, and therefore, one of our most valuable commodities. Your signature gives me the exclusive rights to all the ore in Lumino Cavern. I, of course, will set the price. That ore belongs to all of slug terror. <laughs> Not anymore. Those are... Neotox slugs? No, those are Neurotox ghouls. And I think their presence should bring any negotiation to an end. Agreed. Good. My apprentice will see to the details. And Twist, make sure to do it right. What are you waiting for? Sign it! We're here to renegotiate. You're not gonna use that. You know what it can do. You know what it can do, too. Yeah, we both saw Black take down the unbeatable master. But you're not Black. You don't think I got the guts? You think I'm just gonna let this whole deal go up in flames? <laughs> Loki! <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do if you ever stop falling for Loki's illusions. I'm not sticking around to be a victim. We got a bolt, bro. But oh, we're gonna be stone cold stone. Everybody in there's already a statue. We can trap the cloud with an ice wall. But those miners aren't gonna be saved by letting everyone in this cavern get turned to stone. just kept growing and growing. Like some kind of freaky chain reaction. 
I'm willing to bet it has something to do with those Neotox being ghouls. How much time before it breaks through? I don't know, bro. Just taking a guess, I'd say this puppy's got... Oh, 10 hours, 22 minutes, and 31 seconds before... You know, give or take the five seconds it took to just say that. So, we've got 10 hours to find someone who knows about Neotox slugs and how to stop them. Only one slinger was ever twisted enough to make them his signature slug. Ugh, blight. And he hasn't been seen since your dad locked him up in the Cavern of Time. Huh. He'll have to do. Hold up, bro. The Cavern of Time is like an inescapable maze. Ha! What you are forgetting is that you have a Molinoid to lead you. Think you could get us in and out, Pronto? To find the way in and out of the Cavern of Time, it, it is every Molinoid's dream. Come, let us make history. Uh, <coughs> it's uh, actually the, uh, the other way. So, what's the story with Blight and my dad? His name definitely sounds familiar. Yeah, well, if you grew up in Slug Terra instead of up there, the name wouldn't sound familiar. It would sound terrifying. Blight's slinging style was brutal. He'd hit slingers with the Neotox and then leap into the cloud it created. Blight was protected by his gas mask, but the other slingers were anything but safe. He messed people up pretty bad. Nobody could outfight him. So Will Shane, he didn't even try. Your dad took a huge risk, Eli. But it worked. Blight didn't realize it was a trick until he was trapped. What happened to Blight after that? Nobody knows. It's a one-way trip into this place. Ah, a one-way trip to eternal fame! Yet, uh, by entering, we will put our very lives at risk. If there's a chance to save those miners and everyone else, that's a risk I'll take any day. But that doesn't mean you guys have to. And pass up the chance to document one of the most mysterious places in Slug Terra? Yeah, right. Considering how lost you'd be without me on a normal day, you really think I'd let you go in there without me? Ha-ha! <laughs> Pronto, too! Gladly looks death in the eyes and says, Hey! Wait! You're missing my speech! Stay together. Close together. That's the least of our problems. How are we going to find our way back out? Problem? Ha! If you did not have the greatest tracker of all time, perhaps. Ah, fear not. Pronto is using a secret ancient Molinoid tracking method. Which is... <laughs> if I told you, it would no longer be a secret. But trust me, there is nothing to fear. Ah! Relax, Pronto. It's just a little dinosaur. <clears throat> I was uh, merely startled. Uh, leave this miniature menace to Pronto. Oh, I have deduced that they come in pairs. Not a problem. I can handle two primitive brains just as easily as... Uh, this, however, could be a problem. <laughs> Lava links? Jellyish? Try them all! There's more than enough of these things to go around! We gotta bail! I'll clear out a path, then we roll. Ready? <laughs> He's a good exterminator. Okay, not quite the pest control I was hoping for. Run! Down here. Whoa! Oh, 
Or, you know, not. I'm guessing that's Blight. That's close enough, buddy. We must go. That thing will be angry when it wakes. So, Eli, we're gonna follow the evil dude who may be a little, uh, gloom? Well, it's that, or wait around to be eaten. Pronto would like to propose a third choice, but nothing comes to mind. It's been a long time since I've had... Had what? No victims? <laughs> company. <gasps> That's a good sign. He thinks of us as company. Every creature here is either food or... You know, trying to make you... You've been here for years, I can only imagine. Food. Huh? Food. Oh, my manners. I should have offered you the first bite. <laughs> hmm. It's just that you never know what may be poisonous. <laughs> My keen sense of observation tells me this fellow is, uh, how shall I say, utterly and completely out of his mind. Yeah, but he seems almost nice. You know, in a creepy, weird sort of way. Guys like him don't just change, no matter how long they've been cooped up in the land of the lost. Let's just hope he has enough sense left to help us. We're running out of time. Eli? Uh, yeah. So, uh, we noticed, you know, a thing or two about Neotox slugs, which is good, because we need someone with that kind of expertise. Ugh. We need your help. Uh, come with us to Lumino Cavern. <laughs> what? Come with you. You are as trapped here as I. We are all now lifelong residents of the Cavern of Time. What if I told you we have a way out? We'll lead you there. In exchange for your help with a mutant Neotox cloud that keeps getting bigger. Hmm. A way out. This cloud that won't go away, it's called a, a Neotox Fog. So you know what we're talking about. It happens if you fire too many Neotox at once. I, I can stop a Neotox Fog. You stop it, we'll give you your freedom. <laughs> uh, just a quick sec there, Mr. Blight. You sure about this, Eli? That man is completely out of his guard! Not to mention dangerous. Your dad trapped him in here. You gotta think he's still got a grudge against the Shane. But he doesn't know that's me now. And we're not gonna tell him. I know it's a risk, but it's the only way to save Lumino. Huh? Besides, if it comes down to it, I'm sure we can find a way to handle Blight. Uh, but just to be safe, we'll show you the way out. But first, you're gonna have to hand over your weapons. My reputation precedes me. For a way out, I would do it. anything. Huh? Okay, Pronto. Now it's all on you and your ancient Molinoid secrets. Ah, well, in that case, we are mere moments from our exit. Oh, uh, Pronto? Can't help but notice that it's taking a little more than mere moments. <laughs> well, that is be 
because someone has stolen the trail. Stolen the trail? You mean you lost it? Pronto, we're running out of time. The beast has picked up our scent. Uh, uh, yes, yes, uh, but uh, this will not be a problem, uh, because we can simply follow the trail that I, Pronto, have not lost. My Molinoid tracking has been tampered with. I dropped the breadcrumbs to mark our path, and now they are gone. Yeah, that was your ancient Molinoid secret. Breadcrumbs? Yeah. My trail and then speed it out? You ungrateful beasts! Could you say that any louder? Blight may have missed the fact that we lost the trail. Maybe we could follow the dino yak if we could see it. Ah, yes, well, unfortunately, Pronto can still smell it. That's it, Pronto. You're a genius. Uh, of course I am. Uh, because I can sniff our way out of here. That is right! <laughs> Again! There! This way! We are close! Whoa. That must be the exit! We made it! Let's go! We've got maybe a half hour before the ice wall breaks! Like time just ran out, bro. This fog was created by Neotox slugs. Cool, Neotox slugs. Things have changed since you've been gone. Right. What do we do? My gear. That wasn't the deal. First, take care of the Neotox fog. I can't take care of it without my blaster. The fog first. Save Lumino. Eli, the vines! The ghoul gas must have corrupted him. Blight's done his part. Let's do ours. Again, it is up to Pronto and the Shane Gang to save Shane. Uh oh. Will Shane is no more replaced by a boy? His son, perhaps. I will have my revenge on you. <laughs> Trusting Blight was a mistake, huh? Actually, I was kind of hoping this would happen. What? 
that we get chopped to pieces by evil plants? That Blight had give me a reason to put him back in the cavern of time even after he kept his word. <laughs> right back where he belongs, the Cavern of Time! Stay back, foul cloud! Pronto will not be silent by... Pronto! Don't worry, buddy. Let's just say he's doing some time. <laughs> 